Top, 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 top. It's your girl Jamila with her own boss. This is your boy E Money Boss. Welcome to another episode of the Top Hill Podcast. So sit back, relax, and enjoy. And enjoy. Thirteen years old with a shoebox stash. Uh, I'm always up to something that was sitting on my ass. Thirteen years old with a shoebox stash. Uh, I got a real ass. If this don't make you want to go up and get some money, <laughs> like, this is inspirational to me. Come on, man. That was Key Glock from his Yellow Tape 2, Ambition for Cash. I fuck with that joint. That joint is hard, man. Shout out to Memphis. All right, Jamil, you ready to get into this uh, this episode? And indeed. All right, let me go ahead and t- turn these doubles off. Let me turn these doubles off. All right, so three, two, one. Top, 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 top. top, top. top, top. Welcome to another episode of Top or Not, where we react to new music or music that you guys suggest to that we react to. And uh, yeah, we really greatly appreciate all the love that we've been receiving in the comments. Shout out to you guys. Um, If you guys are new here, this is our very first real reactions to these records. Um, There's no cap here. We're going to be completely honest. Um, And we know there's times that we listen to music back and, you know, we catch stuff later on. But we're going to give you guys our real actual reaction uh, to these records. So, yeah, hope you guys enjoy. And let's get into it. So we're gonna do one record from Sir Cody today too. I feel like we can't react to Cotograph and not react to Sir Cody. It feels like like one I gotta do both. Alright. So we got another freestyle from Ooh. from Sir Cody. I um, loved the last one, so I can't wait to see what's next. Yeah, he was preach. He was literally preaching on that last freestyle that he did, and I loved every single bar of that jump. So, every single last one of them. I don't know why he was rapping with that one boy though. <laughs> yeah, for sure. I don't even remember his name. But anyway, uh, Sarkody, <laughs> he did another freestyle. This is actually at the Grammy. Uh, he actually did this at the Grammy Museum um, in California. So um, this was, a, I think, around the BET Awards in 2015. This is um, so anyway, let's go ahead and react to it. Sarkody Cody Freestyle at the Grammy Museum. Gotta brace ourselves. Oh, commercial break. This reaction is brought to you by the Top Hill Podcast, where we react to brand new music that you guys suggest to. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Thank you. Bye-bye. 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 All right, here we go. Oh, <laughs> Young and skinny Sarko. Never. Cause the Lua is involved. I'm still trying to figure out how I'm going to make it. Do I got to speak English? I hate it. I wish y'all could understand my language. It's beautiful. So y'all can call me the greatest. You know, when I listen to Kendrick, spit low bars and keeping it hundred, I'm like, damn, I really know I can do it and do it better if I gotta speak in my language. Then I listen to J. Cole. Then I listen to Big Sean. Only if they know, all I gotta work on is the flow and the dick shot. African is big girl, African flow. See, I'm taking my time, I'm taking everything slow. Everything slow. Switch it. We are sure some of them. What's the enemy? Don't really wanna talk about an enemy. We free the poor much of the enemy. I wonder what time you make living, baby. I don't know if you want to be feeling in a grand in cinema. Want to take a cut and a book of routine, but I don't want to get from someone to ask you. You're popping at the living room, you're really sick. You're sitting in the number two from a CIA. I get the moon to me, get you from what we came to. I see what I put in the other one. Came from the bottom and I'm headed to the top. What I want, everybody check it out. Yo. Show me what will go past me, but what I can have a little figure good enough. I came in my goal to do what I saw what kind of shot, but I'm gonna hit him up. I 
African boy, you can't understand me, but I know you're feeling us. And she's speaking back in Africa in English, but still I know they must. Oh my God. I remember when I told my dad that I'm gonna be a superstar. I feel you, but it's been so far. Guess what? I'm in USA. You gotta believe in the things she said. I didn't see my millimeters, but what's in my gun? I got my to my foot in the pen and then stick. God damn it. Yo, Shout out to the hype man. I'm seeing that I wanna step it up. I don't follow the rules because I've been part of the law breakers. No matter what we do, I put the shit in him, no pass a drop. This guy be one of the ground shakers. No matter what I'm saying, I tell them all the shit. I don't want to tell my business. I'm a liar. I don't be part of the ground breakers. But I'm just a sustainer in the back for over 80 years, and then I come back to come in another. When I meet you, me nigga, man, who the quality that they deny? The people just to see me suffer, but they come from my face. Cause I'm so cheap in the gear, took me a couple of years for them to see me suffer. Moving away from all the jealousy, the envy, the social support. Two plus the bride, go plus suckers. I made it to the top, didn't do it alone. To all my fans, every time I hold it to the bone, I'm just giving it back like you gave me a loan. I'm still killing my time, but I still put a short. If you fuck with me, but I pick up a sword. When we got trouble, I'm the illness on the microphone. When I got the sack, yeah, this is the blood of my brother. Then my nook can keep a torch. See, I really hate big ass niggas. Big cats take us on with the silver bitches on with the niggas queen savers. Take a new one for taking your racks on with them on with the food speakers. I said my collection in your pool so when I come up the big new sneakers. Big cats take us. Hold up. Oh my god, man. Yo. I'ma say this about uh Sarkody and and what this freestyle really reminded what taught me about him I feel like he was really above his time um, I feel like in his bars and his lyrics you can tell like he's like yo like I know you guys love Kendrick and Cole and Sean like why do I have to speak English for you guys to understand and hear me like I'm just as great as these artists that you guys love and listen to his lyrical performance here. I mean, obviously, he, he got it. He has everything that um, our favorite artists here in the States um, have. He has it. You know what I mean? He has the, the confidence. He has the swag, the flow, the bars. Um, he, he delivers on, on every single category. So um, it's great to see him sticking with it and being consistent and becoming the artist and the man that he is today. I think it's super dope. And love discovering his music and going back to it. Me too. I definitely agree with that. Yeah. He's also one of those master manifestors as well. Like you can just hear, especially from like yeah. all his old music and stuff like that. He always said who he was going to be, how it was going to be, For sure. and it's exactly how he said it was going to be. <laughs> exactly. Yep. Another one, man. You just gotta stay consistent, keep at it. You know what I mean? That's that's the secret sauce right there. All right. That's top 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 shit. If you guys didn't know, let us know in the comments um, what we should react to next. Shout out to Ghana, man. Uh, yeah, amazing. Top hill, top hill, top hill. They don't know. Top hill, top hill, top hill. Just subscribe.